Anthony Batt. Oh, Neil Anthony Batt. Take you, Laura Chambers. Take you, Laura Chambers. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. I, Laura Chambers. I, Laura Chambers. Take you, Neil Anthony Batt. Take you, Neil Anthony Batt. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. Today, Neil and Laura have come to make public their love for each other and to declare their choice to live and grow together. They have invited you all here, the people who are important to them, to share this very special moment with them and to witness their commitment to each other in this very special bond of marriage. With two people, Pledged to love and care for each other in marriage, they create a spirit unique to themselves which binds them closer than any spoken or written word. From the first time I met you, 30th of August 2012, I knew I wanted you in my life. In my eyes, it's always been you. It just took you a bit longer to realise. A lot of people always used to say to me that good things come to those who wait. Well, they were right. Look at us now, we've got a lovely home, our little fur baby Reggie, and most of all, Mackenzie, a beautiful little boy. I truly feel like the luckiest girl in the world right now. I'll always be by you through good and bad. I'm so proud to be calling you my husband. Love you forever, Mr. Pat. Laura, my best friend, my soulmate, and the best mother to our boy, and soon to be my wife, my wife now, sorry. Every day I think how lucky I am to have you in my life. I am sorry it's taken so long for us to be together, but good things come to those who wait. You go to work every day missing our boy so we can have a good life together and do the things we deserve to do and have. I promise to love you for who you are and for who you are yet to become. I promise to share my whole heart with you and to remember, remember to show you how deeply I care for you. Today I promise to be your best friend and your husband for the rest of your days. Love you, Nugget. Laura, I give you this ring. As a token of our marriage. As a token of our marriage. And a symbol of our love. And a symbol of our love. Neil, I give you this ring. Neil, I give you this ring. As a token of our marriage. As a token of our marriage. And a symbol of our love. And a symbol of our love. And now, in accordance with the law of this country and the vows that you have made together, it's my privilege and pleasure to declare that you are husband and wife. Congratulations. <laughs>
if you could please stand for your new Mr. and Mrs. Bat. Well, so thank you all for sharing this morning, Laura's special day with us. I promise not to waffle on. Um, I'll be honest, this ain't the most strongest point. Laura was blessed to us and made us a family. Even with a small child, she was caring to others, as in as today. Most of you know the real the real truth is that it, that took my time and to come to think about it, what taken me so long because I missed out on so many years of you in my life. And I've known Neil most of my life now, and I want to I honestly want to say he's probably one of the most kind-hearted, beautiful people inside and out. He'll do absolutely anything for anyone. And if you know Neil, like most of you do in this room, you'll understand um, what type of guy he is. You are doing an amazing job at both being a mother to Mackenzie and now wife to me. Please do not stop being an amazing woman. I promise to never stop loving you. Neil's a lo lovely, genuine lad and he's made Laura very happy, which makes us, which makes us happy. I think he's definitely going to be a brilliant husband, a brilliant dad, and you've definitely picked the best Harley lad. You look so beautiful and I cannot thank you enough for saying yes when I asked you to marry me just over a year ago. For the happy couple, we wish you many years of happiness and pleasant years together. I love you both more than anything. Uh, to the bride and groom. <laughs>